hi guys welcome back to cali j's kitchen in today's video i'll take you guys back in the kitchen with me and i'll show you how to prepare this really easy and simple curry shrimp don't forget to subscribe to my channel turn on your post notification bell so you guys can always be notified whenever i upload a new video go ahead and tell your friends tell your family members about cali j's kitchen and have them subscribe to my channel follow me on instagram it's Kali Kitchen underscore one and also on Facebook it's Kali J's Kitchen so here I have my shrimp it's already clean and washed and also de -veined. so what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna go ahead and season my shrimp of course I'm gonna add some of my black pepper some of my onion powder and some of my garlic powder I will also add some paprika some of my all-purpose seasoning some of my seasoned salt and also some of my curry powder now I'm using the Indian curry however you have different brands of curry on the market you can always go ahead and use any one that you like you know some people have their preference when it comes on to curry powder and me personally i like to use better pack but better pack is a little bit hard for me to get so i'm going to use the next best option which is the indian curry and always remember guys that you must be creative and just utilize whatever you have at home i will also add some of my cilantro and some of my oregano to this and of course combine all of that goodness together now all of these ingredients that i'm using Using today you can get it at your local supermarket or grocery shop remember to be creative remember to be you in the kitchen and most of all utilize whatever you have at home once my shrimp is nice seasoned combine all of that goodness together because you want to ensure that your shrimp is nice seasoned and of course you're gonna put it to the side for roughly about 15 minutes and then we're gonna come back and start preparing all of the goodness for our shrimp and of course i slice up some onion some garlic some scotch bonnet pepper and some of my carrots already that i'm gonna add to my shrimp and also some of my bell peppers so here i have my pot i added some vegetable oil and then i went in and add my curry powder of course we're gonna allow our curry to burn a little bit but you don't want it to be too dark and then i'm gonna go in and add some scotch bonnet pepper and all of that garlic just to get the flavor and of course combine that together nicely and you always want to ensure that you turn your stove on medium heat and then we're going to go in and add our onion once we add the onion we're just going to combine everything together nicely again turn your stove on medium heat and then we're going to go in and of course add our carrot and like i said you want to extract all of that flavor all of that goodness we don't want your carrots to be too soft we want them to be crunchy and nice so once we add the carrot of course we're going to combine all of that goodness together again and we're just going to cover it and leave it there for roughly about three minutes and then we're going to come back and i will show you guys what it looks like now you can always go ahead and have your curry shrimp with some white rice you can have it with rice and peas you can have it with some potato whatever you have at home just be creative guys like i always encourage you to be and just be you in the kitchen and utilize whatever you have at home all right your family will love this you can always go ahead and prepare it for dinner i mean for lunch if you're having a little party you can always go ahead and prepare some amazing curry shrimp all right so this is it looking all lovely and nice of course you're just just gonna combine everything together again nicely and then we're gonna go ahead and of course add our shrimp all right so the container that i seasoned the shrimp in of course i added a little bit of water to it just to get out all of that seasoning and then we're going to pour the water all over our shrimp and of course combine everything together again nicely no need to add any more seasoning because this is well seasoned so we're just going to combine everything together nicely once we add the small amount of water and then we're going to cover it and of course we're going to add the bell peppers first or once it's almost finished cooking you can always go ahead and add the bell pepper or if you want to add it at this stage you can always go ahead and do so once i add bell pepper combine everything 
together nicely and then we're going to cover it and give it five to six minutes and then i'll come back and show you guys what it looks like i serve mine up with some white rice really amazing i do have some recipe on my channel for white rice you can always go ahead and check it out and this is the final product of my amazing curry shrimp so i hope you guys enjoy today's recipe and i hope you guys go ahead and try it out and let me know what you think remember to subscribe to my channel remember to turn on your post notification bell so you can always be notified whenever i upload a new video tell your friends and your family members about cali j's kitchen and have them subscribe we're on our way to 10k subscribers so help me get there by subscribing and sharing bye guys